Hey, what's going on, Obscure Mike people? It is Bark coming at you with another microphone review. And uh, this one is not in the studio because it is like six degrees and I can't even get it warm up there in the studio. So AKG C5 handheld condenser microphone coming at you. Uh, let's talk about what comes with it. AKG pouch. Mm-hmm. Yep. Documentation. Mm-hmm. Yep. And a really nice AKG clip with a 3-8-5-8 adapter. That's it besides the box itself. Now, let's take a look at the capsule real quick. I'm going to unscrew the head. Ooh, I like that. Uh, so it's got some plastic protection here. I don't know if that's part of the pop filter protection or what. It, it's it's quality, though, like most AKG mics are. No bells, no whistles, no switches. C5 build quality is excellent. Very strong metal. Tapping on it, it's not hollow or anything like that at all. Handling noise. Solid as a rock as well. <sighs> this is the part where I put it through its paces in my makeshift studio. Peter Piper picked a peck of pickled pineapple pizza. Peter Piper picked a peck of pickled pineapple pizza. And when you get right on top of the AKG C5, this is what it sounds like when you are right on top of the AKG C5. This is what it sounds like. Off-axis noise rejection. Talking into the front of the microphone. Going to turn it 90 degrees so you can hear the off-axis coloration. 180 degrees so you can see the head of this thing. That's what she said. Yes! 90 degrees again. And slowly back around to the front of the microphone. Yes, the big, big head. It's uh, quite desirable. Quite desirable. Not many complaints about this mic. The build quality is excellent. The off-axis rejection for condenser, even if handheld, is pretty solid. Uh, every Everything about it screams quality, and the sound is pretty good. It is definitely pretty good. I like it. It is a little bit on the uh, maybe a tad bit scooped sound, like there's some low end, there's some high end sizzle, not a lot of mid forward sound in my opinion. It's just kind of top and bottom. There's enough mids there to keep it respectable, but it, it just lacks a little bit of that I'm here punch uh, in trade off for some of that shimmery sizzle up top. I, I don't. Like it's it's clear enough in my headphones, but it, it's not anything crazy. There's nothing just jumping off the page to me. It sounds like a good quality handheld condenser. And there's nothing wrong with that whatsoever. I mean, it's a good quality handheld condenser. The reason I say there's nothing particularly special about this microphone is because I did a little uh, shootout in my studio of this and two other handheld condenser mics, both of which I think I liked a little bit more. So when I first plugged this in, I thought that's pretty good. But when I tried out one mic in particular against it, that is a, of similar price, I was like, I clearly dislike the AKG in comparison. So sometimes you just need those comps and uh, I would bring them to you, but I haven't reviewed the other mics yet and I want to give them their own time to shine. So you know, it's uh, maybe I'll just take a clip of this video and a clip of that video and make a short. That's an idea. Mic comps, short style, 30 seconds a piece, and, and you'll, you'll, you'll get what you get. You'll get what you get. You know, I don't give a whole lot. I just buy these shits, talk into them for you. It's as much as I can give. That's about me being maxed out on what I can give to the YouTube community. Anyways, uh, I think the AKG C5 is a fine microphone used. They don't go for a lot used. They're not in demand. 
it's kind of obscure. Not a whole lot of people give a crap about these mics, honestly. Uh, so if you can find it used, you can probably get it between 75 and 100 and I think it runs 150 Link down below if you like it enough to grab it new, but I do suggest you try to find it used. You can get a heck of a better deal uh, grabbing this microphone used. And again, it is a good microphone. I could fault no one for using these all around a podcast setup. Uh, couldn't really fault anybody for doing vocals on them, maybe a little voiceover. It's, it is definitely good enough to do most of your standard tasks and, and do it well. It's quality. There, you know, nothing wrong here. It's just not going to be on any kind of obscure Mike's award ceremony show. Maybe something like that in the future. It, it's not going to be anything like that, but you, you, you can't go wrong if you grab it for 75 or a hundred bucks. You just can't. It's good. It's good. Perfectly good. It's good. It's good. It's good. Field goals all over the NFL. I barely watch it anymore, but a lot of field goals. Three points. This thing. Easy. Three of them. Is that a new scoring system? Green light? Three points? Five points? Two points? I don't know. Obscure Mike's AKGC5 is out. Bark is out. I'll see you guys next time. Hopefully in the studio that's not below zero or close to it on Obscure Mike's. Peace out.